Hello everyone, welcome back to TS Info YouTube channel. I am Chandrika, an IT analyst in TS Info Technologies. You might be heard about lookup column in the SharePoint. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain you how to update the SharePoint online lookup column values by using a Power Automate flow. Open Power Automate by logging into it with your Microsoft credentials. Now in the Power Automate, I will create an automated cloud flow to update the values of the SharePoint list lookup column values. Before creating the flow, let me show you the SharePoint list which I will use and connect it to the Power Automate flow. This is the list I have created. I have taken countries list with the title column, serial number and country as the single line of text. And another list I will use is user registration list. This is the user registration list where the title column is the user name and age is the number column, location is the location column which is associated with the city, location city column and email address is also a single line of text column. In this user registration list, I will create one more column with the country taking from the country's list as a lookup column. While coming to the lookup column, it is like creating a relationship between the two lists in a SharePoint. Like it will connect the list or library to a column of another list or library. Like it will display the data from another list or library. I will show you it with example by creating a lookup column here. So let's create a lookup column here. Click on the plus icon and select the data type as lookup and click on next. In the name, provide it as country. In the type, we can see it is a lookup column. And we have to select the list source, that is country's list that I have shown previously. In select a column from the list above, we have to select one column that will be associated with the lookup column from the country's list. In this, I was selecting the country as an example so that it will replicate all the values of the countries present in the country list to the user registration list. So let's click on save. In the country lookup column, it will show all the country values which have been stored in the country's list. Now we have to update this country column automatically without taking it as manually based on the location city. If the location city is San Francisco, then it should update its country as United States of America. So let's see how to create this flow. Now come back to the Power Automate and select Create button. After that, select Automated Cloud Flow. Here I was giving the flow name as Lookup Column Updating and select the trigger as when an item is created and click on Create. The flow trigger is added to the Flow Studio and select the site address and list name from the drop down. After that, add Get Item Flow action. In the Get Item Flow action, Select site address, list name and ID from the drop down. Select ID from when an item is created from the dynamic content in the get item flow action. After that, add one more step to add the condition control. In the condition control, I was giving the condition based on the location city. If the location city is San Francisco, then it will update the lookup column country value as United States of America. In the similar way, I was one more condition to it. If the location city is New York, then also it will update as United States of America in the country column. In the choose value, select location city from the dynamic content is equals to provide the city name here. I was adding one more location city column. If the location city is equals to New York, then also it will update the country value as USA. So under if s condition, click on add an action to add update item flow action in the update item flow action provide site address list name id along with the updated country value in the country id we have to select the country country id or country name that is reflecting from the country's list when we click on the drop down here it will reflect all the countries that have been placed in the country's list now i will select the united states of america here now the flow is ready this is the entire flow I have created. To view the article on updating of the lookup column, click on the link provided in the description box. Now the flow has been ready and click on save and test the flow manually. In the test box, select manually and click on text. Now come back to the SharePoint list. 
now i will add an item here in the location column i will be selecting the location either san francisco or new york then it will update the country column with the country name exit the grid view see in the country column it has been updated to united states of america from i have given only one example based on the updating of lookup column values through a power automate flow but there are many more scenarios and many more examples for updating of the lookup column values in the sharepoint list by power automate flow for more video tutorials on sharepoint online power apps power automate and power bi like share and subscribe to our youtube channel thank you